Tough day for a local family. Their four-year-old dog is recovering right now after Newport News police shot it while responding to a burglary call. It happened today on Kingsbury Drive right off Warwick Boulevard. Chinuhurst spoke to the dog's owner about what happened. It's an interview you'll see only on 13 News Now. Police say when they got to the home here on this street, they told the woman inside of the house to secure the dog, but her husband says before she was able to do that, the dog lunged out of the front door and bit the officer on the arm. What started out as a police response to a burglary call ended with Matthew Rogers' dog, Brock, shot. In a situation like that, of course, it's very upsetting as far as him getting shot. One of the two officers shot Brock after he bit the other. Matthew's wife immediately took the dog to the vet. I don't know if he was shot twice or if he the bullet had went through his head and came out another out um, another part of his body and hit his toe. But um, I do know uh, there was a fracture of his toe that needs to be amputated and um, he was shot in the head. The last thing an officer wants to do is shoot a canine. Uh, you know, do anything else besides that. But if it resorts to that, unfortunately, that's something we may have to do. The officer who was bitten only had minor injuries. Brock's condition, however, is still up in the air, which is hard for Matthew and his wife to handle because their other dog just died earlier this month. These incidents, this is just horrible. You know, these, like I said, these dogs are like our kids, so. I don't know. Despite the tough situation this family is facing right now, they're not pointing fingers at anyone, just wrestling with how things played out. Things happen the way that they happen, and we can't change it. So, like I said, the only thing we can do is just pray for the best. And like I said, the officer did his job. I'm not upset at him. I'm, you know, hopefully he's okay. In Newport News, Chinuhurt, 13 News Now.